Okay, here we go. Here we were going right. now. We're going to go say hello to Gloria now. Well, this is kind of a thrill for me because, you know, I just came back from Nova Scotia. Did you? Oh, yes. That's where visiting, been. visiting her son. Oh. Mrs. Dubach, don't get up. <laughs> you look wonderful. How are you? Hey, and you're watching the best channel on TV. Isn't that true? I am so impressed. We even play the uh, some of the music you might like, too, a little bit. Oh, really? Well, yeah, sure we do. It was nice to see you your son. You and David have been friends a long time. We have. Did you like the show I did about his life up Great. there? Doesn't he have a special life? Doesn't he, though? He does. I mean, it just gets better for that guy, it and seems. And he finally settled down. With an, an amazing person, Isn't I must you tell you. Know? You never had a chance to go up to Nova Scotia, though, no. did you? Okay. No. Yeah. So how are you doing? Good. Yeah. Look where I am. I know. They take you good care of you? <laughs> On Main Street. <laughs> you know, a lot of people know you. I You've know. been here for so long. I taught him to swim. That's what you're famous <laughs> for. That's right. The swimming teacher. Yeah. Do you, you know, teaching. Isn't it a wonderful thing? Pardon? Teaching. To teach. Yeah. To teach something. To give back something yes. at some yeah. point. Whether it's a job or even just to teach. Right. Um, now you were married. I forgot what your husband's name was because I never met him. George. George. And didn't he run, didn't he run the uh, Boys and Girls Club for many years? That was his life. He just lived that. He did? Every building we go into that was for sale or, or nice, he'd say, this would make a good boys club. <laughs> oh, really? That's right. Back then it was just the boys club. Yeah. They didn't have girls That's then. what he loved. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. So you guys came here from Washington, D.C., is that correct? Originally? Yes, that was our first move when we were married. The Washington, D.C. Boys Club needed a swimming director. And he applied and he got it. We were only there about three years, two, two or three years. Then we came back to New York State. Then... I'm forgetting things. Okay, yeah, well, that's okay. You came back to and New York then, State, yeah. Uh, we worked there for a while, and then he applied to Nantucket. And I didn't even know that, that there was a, a big place like that, an island. I didn't even know, hadn't been out of, out of New York State. Where were you born? Binghamton, New York. Oh, okay. And how did you meet your husband? Swimming. Really? <laughs> was he your Was he your swimming teacher? Or no, no. Was he teaching? He was a good-looking kid. Oh, he was. And I just kept track of him. And was he from Binghamton too? Yeah. Oh, yeah. so you guys were. Yeah. From the same town. Yeah. Did you go to school together in high school? And We uh, communicated between two high schools. There were two high schools. So, oh. oh, George is walking around the hall with so and so. And then I'd ask him, you know. We're showing lots of tunics this summer. Oh, my God. I finally won him. Did, did, you, did you have a break? between? Did, how long did it take before you got married? To him. Oh, about five years, six oh, years. Yeah. That's We're the same classes together, only separate school. Right. And then, then you got out of high school, and then what did you do for the five years? Got married. You mean you got married immediately? <laughs> How old were you when you got married? You're 18. Wow. Any regrets getting married so early? Do you, do you have any regrets about being married so early? No. No? It was good. Fine. Getting married at 18 was great. Well, that's what everybody did in those days. Right. Yeah, they did, didn't they? Yeah. And how long between kids did you wait before you had your first child? 
Did you take a break? A or year. A year. And then Marshall was born. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And everybody knows Marshall on Nantucket. Yeah. Because he paints incredibly well. And then David. And then David was born. Three years. And there was a light from heaven yeah. the day he was born, right? Yeah. <laughs> Good old David, huh? Is he... What kind of... You happy with him as a son? I mean, are you proud of him? Oh, he's the best person in the world. Really. Is he still here right now? Or did he go back today? Yeah, Debbie left. She had to get that boat. Okay, Debbie's and, your daughter. And, uh, yeah. As far as I know, he's here. He still could be here, okay. But you never know when he's going to leave. Right. Yeah, I get you. But he's, he's slowing down. Yes, he is. But that's okay. We're all slowing down. I'm slowing down. Yeah. Absolutely. So you 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 are a recent uh, resident here. Uh, within the last what year? You moved in in the past we year. We moved here in '51. No, no, I meant here at the homestead. Oh, at the homestead. Yeah, you just kind of. Two years. Has it been two years already? Almost. Wow, yeah. going fast. And you're liking it? Is it okay? Yeah. Oh, that's good. If you need anything, you know where I live, just down the street. David, David will call me and I'll come by. All right, so you always got somebody down there. Thank you. You're welcome. It's great to see you. Great to see you. Thanks. I'll see you soon.